this is Rajendra and in this particular video we are going to discuss about very important topic regarding what is the use of underscore underscore name underscore underscore main method okay so basically you must have seen a lot of python code and in this code you must have seen this particular statement if underscore underscore name underscore underscore double equal to and then in the quotes underscore underscore main underscore underscore right and then this is a block right so you must have seen this kind of a code in a every python module so what is the importance of this line so let's try to understand what it is so basically every python module we can run independently so for example let's say this code.py is my one module it has some function let's say I have one addition function okay which has two arguments for now and this function is simply returning addition of two values right this is the simplest possible function we have right so now when we run this particular file directly saying python code.py if you run this file basically what happens this double underscore name double underscore this particular attribute this is a special attribute or a special variable we can call it is in python so this particular attribute get initialized with a value double underscore main double underscore and that's the reason okay if this variable gets initialized with the underscore main this condition becomes true and we can call this method here addition okay where you can pass 10 comma 20 and this function will be called okay let me add one print statement as well what does this mean this file ran directly okay or you can say this file got executed directly right now if you are running this file directly you will observe that now if I just run python python code.py so you can see it is returning this file ran directly okay so we have not added a print statement here that's why it's not printing the addition but let me use that as well here so now I'm just saving this file go back to the terminal and I'm just running this file directly you can see we are getting the addition as well as we are getting message this file ran directly so what does that mean when you run this file directly as a module this particular attribute get initialized with a value underscore underscore main and that's the reason this if condition gets true and we are able to call the function and this particular print statement is also getting executed now let's consider this particular code.py module we are importing in some other file let's say let me do import code this particular module we are importing and then let me write a similar statement here because this is again a pile.py is again a module right so underscore underscore name double equal to in a quotes underscore underscore main double underscore right and then what we can do is now we have imported a code module so we can just do code dot add okay what is our method name it's addition so we can just call this as addition and we can pass some vari values okay and it is returning some so let's take it in variable and then we can just print it okay that is written so now this is again a file dot py is one module so obviously when we run this file okay obviously this condition will be true and we have imported this code module so we are able to use call we are able to call this addition method and we'll get the reply so let me first run it and then we'll come back so i'm just doing python and our file name is file.py so here you can see we got the uh, we got this uh, addition as 30 so what exactly happened here okay even though we imported that whole code.py you can see this code does not got executed why so because the value of name is not initialized for this code.py 
it got initialized for file.py and that's the reason this code got executed but even if we have imported code.py here okay when we import the underscore underscore name variable for this particular file will not be initialized with this main and that's the reason this code will not get executed okay and that's the reason okay that's the reason uh, this underscore underscore name attribute becomes very important why so if you want to individually test your module you can simply run that module and you will be able to test its whole functionality but if when you are importing it with so importing it in some other file we have to make sure that uh, some specific code that should not be executed right and that's the reason we should always in every module you should always write this block and from that block you can write some specific code that will be executed only if you are running this file directly so i hope everyone understood the meaning of this particular if block so that's it about this video if you have any question any comment just feel free to write it in the comment section of video and don't forget to like subscribe share the channel thanks everyone